The unfinished portrait of Franklin D. Roosevelt is a watercolor of Franklin Delano Roosevelt, President of the United States, by Elizabeth Shaumatoff. Shaumatoff was commissioned to paint a portrait of President Roosevelt and started her work around noon on April 12, 1945. At lunch, Roosevelt complained of a headache and subsequently collapsed. The president, who had suffered a cerebral hemorrhage, died later that day. Shaumatoff never finished the portrait, but she later painted a new, largely identical one, based on memory. The unfinished portrait hangs at Roosevelt's retreat, the Little White House, in Warm Springs, Georgia, with its finished counterpart beside it. In 1943, painter Elizabeth Shaumatoff was told by her friend and client Lucy Mercer Rutherford, who was also known for being the president's mistress. Rutherford would go on to make the arrangements, with Shaumatoff agreeing to sit in for two days within two weeks' time. She said of the agreement, I was trapped into something I had neither wished for nor planned. She went on to talk about not being able to turn down the honor of being selected for a presidential commission. Elizabeth Shaumatoff had begun working on the portrait of the president around noon on April 12, 1945. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe if you would like to view more of our videos. Have a nice day.